Manhattan Hospital in New York City, a towering modern medical building, shines with a cold silver light under the city lights. But as night falls, the busy hospital becomes quiet, mysterious, and full of unknown shadows. Emily, the nurse who works here, is a sweet, smiling girl. However, every time night falls, her smile will be replaced by an indescribable fear, because this hospital is not only a battlefield between life and death, but also a city full of unknown fog. One night, Emily was urgently called to the sixth floor. It was an abandoned ward that no one cared about and had long been closed. With fear in her heart, she walked alone into the place full of death. She saw a man sitting quietly by the bed with blood stains on the ground around him. The man's name was Alan. He was a surgeon at the hospital. He was forced to leave due to an operation error. He and Emily met, and the relationship between them gradually heated up. But this relationship also triggered new horrors. Alan's appearance aroused a deep shadow in the hospital. A series of strange events began to occur in the hospital. The patient's condition suddenly deteriorated. The medical equipment operated on its own. And the most frightening thing was that unknown figures began to appear in some corners of the hospital. At the same time, Alan's mental state began to become abnormal. He began to be troubled by nightmares, in which he was struggling on the operating table, being chased, betrayed, and accused. His spirit gradually collapsed and he became the prey of fear and anxiety. Emily decided to help Alan, and she began to investigate the secrets of the hospital. She discovers that this hospital not only has a dark history, but also hides a horrifying secret. The sixth floor of the hospital is a place used for taboo experiments. Emily and Alan are thus plunged into a vortex of fear and death. They must face the dark side of the hospital and face their own fears. Only in this way can they find the light. However, the story does not end there. Alan suddenly disappeared, leaving Emily alone to face this horrific world. She found Alan deep in the hospital, his eyes empty and fear on his face. Finally, Emily stood on the roof of the hospital, looking at the gray sky, filled with doubts and fear. Where did Alan go? Is he still alive? What is the secret of this hospital?